think I'm, I think we're just about to get a surprise guest. Hello! We've not done a little video for a long time, have we? Just making an appearance, are we? Hmm. We just got back from Krakow yesterday in Poland. I had the best time. Oh my goodness, I missed you though. Yeah, we just got back yesterday and I had an absolute blast. We went for four days. Um, I love you so much. I would have definitely stayed longer if it wasn't for you. While we were there, I did some research before um, and oh, my wee honey. I knew that there were Sephora's, um, which I was very excited about. There are three Sephora's in Krakow. There are also a Bath and Body Works, which was a nice surprise. The only time I've been to Bath and Body Works is when I've been in America. Same with Sephora actually, I've never been to a Sephora in Europe. So it was a nice, ah, Robin, come on, ow! Dude, I'm trying to record. Doesn't care. Anyway, so I did a little beauty haul because obviously, I've tr it's fake. Anyway. So I did a beauty haul when I was in Krakow and I haven't opened anything because I wanted to do a little video. So I'm going to share with you what I bought. I have things, actually I'm just going to show you because I can't remember where I got everything. So I did quite the beauty haul. We've got lots of bath and body works and obviously Sephora and some Inglot. So I'm just going to go through them with you. And this is my favourite part about doing a little unboxing beauty haul because I forget what I bought. <sighs> So this is just it's exciting for me. Mm, oh, what am I going to start with? Oh my god, there's too much choice. Bath and Body Works, let's do it. Okay. Oh my god, I can smell from the power. So there were two um, main big shopping malls in Krakow that I went to. They have three Sephora's. They have one kind of on like the main touristy part and um, just off the square. I think it's Florenska Street. So they've got one there, they've got one in the Galleria Krakowska. They have another one in the second shopping mall which is the Galleria Kazimierz, which is in the Jewish quarter, which I'll do another video on because it's amazing. I don't know if they've got a Bath and Body Works in the Kazimierz one, but they do in the Krakowska. So anyway, I'm just gonna go into it. So this is the first little bag. This. I wish they had smell a vision on YouTube because these smell wonderful. So the first thing I got was a little gift set the in the stars and actually when I went up to the checkout to buy this um, the woman at the counter told me it was buy one get one free and I nearly died. So I got this one and I also got into the night so I got into the stars in the stars and into the night for free which is insane and um, I had already chosen this one and I looked up this one. I kind of wanted it, but by that point I'd already bought quite a lot. So I wasn't sure. However, when she said it was for free, I was like, oh, okay then, yes. And they both smell amazing. So this gift set has a 24 hour moisturizer and the Ultra Shea Body Cream, the Shea Butter Hand Cream. It also has, it's a pretty decent size, the Fine Fragrance Mist. Also, Shea and Vitamin E Shower Gel. And these, I honestly, oh my god. I really wish you could smell it. Oh! Oh my god, oh my god. So you get four things in this gift set. And a cute little bag as well, which has got little mermaid scales on it. This cost 199 zloty, which is another thing. Poland they don't use a the euro, they have their own currency, which is called the zloty. So this gift set was 199 zloty, which... Bear with me and I'll let you know what that is in pounds. Okay, so 199 zloty is 40 pounds. So for 40 quid, I got two gift sets, which is amazing. Into the night, you get, so there's not as much in the Into the Night gift set, but you get three products. So you get the shower gel, the fine fragrance mist, and the moisturizer. So you get basically your three steps, your shower gel, your moisturizer, and your body mist. So you're still going to smell fabulous. This one its own, if you were just going to buy this, this was a little bit cheaper. This was 169 zloty. It's £33, like about, it's about £34. So it's a little bit cheaper, but you get less products. Um, at the moment though, they have the offer. So if you are around a bath and body works, go and get yourself a little deal. Okay, 
I've got one more Bath and Body Works bag. Oh yes, if I remember I've got these. So one of my friends in America sent me over um, a care package a few months ago and in it was a lot of products from Bath and Body Works because I'm obsessed. She sent me this cute little mm, fragrance holder kind of thing for your car and sent over some like, pumpkin spice car refills for it. It smells incredible. Anytime somebody gets into my car they always say how nice it smells and I'm like I know it's amazing. So I bought a few of the refills when I was there. Funnily enough I got into the night and in the stars. So I actually bought these first before I actually saw the gift sets. I think they were about 20 zloty each but it was buy, buy two get one three. So to be awkward I bought four. <laughs> So basically 20 zloty is four pounds, so they're like four pounds each, which is not bad. And then, oh my gosh, I got so many of these, I forgot what I got that. I'm so excited. Oh my goodness. And then I bought these little things. These are my favorite things ever. So they're the cleansing hand gel. The first day I went into the Bath and Body Works, I was like, where are they? And I went up to the girl at the counter and asked them and she said they were sold out. And then I saw on Facebook that people are freaking out and panic buying because of the coronavirus. So I was raging that people... <sighs> anyway, I bought seven of these, not because I'm stockpiling in case of the coronavirus. Come at me. <laughs> Don't really. It's just because I love them so much. So again, I got into the stars. In the stars. In the stars. Hot cocoa and cream. I like you a lot, which is like an ice cream flavour. Hot cocoa and cream smells like that. Hot cocoa and cream, funnily enough. Got another I like you a lot, and then I got a black cherry melot. Merlot, obviously. So I bought one, two, three, four, five, six, seven of those. I bought a whole bunch of them because I'm not, I don't know when I'm going to be back, and I, use, I do actually use quite a lot of hand gel, I use them in between my clients and I just want to have nice smelling paws. So these little hand gels were, I think they were about 2 99 zloty, which is... Nah, that can't be right. 60 pence! I would have bought a whole lot more if I realised that. No, that can't be right. 2 99 Nay, we. Well, there you go. Which is another thing, Pol well, I can't say all of Poland, but Krakow is so cheap, oh my gosh. Some of the food we went out for, I mean, we were having meals um, and drinks with our meals and it wouldn't even come to like 20 quid. It's a great place to go if you're maybe on a budget or you want a nice holiday but you don't spend a lot or whatever. And by no means are you missing out on anything. The culture's amazing, the food's amazing, the locals are amazing, the sightseeing is amazing, the history is amazing. It's just incredible. The shopping is amazing. I cannot recommend crack off enough. Okay, next bag I got is from Inglot. Now I got this one in Galleria Casu Mirage, but there is an Inglot in both the shopping centres. I know that for sure. As popular as Inglot is, and especially with makeup artists, I've personally not used any of their products before. They get recommended to me all the time by other artists, but I just, I just not went into a shop. Anyway, let's see what's in the Inglot bag. <sighs> Forgot I got these. Oh my god. Oh my god, so, oh my god, okay, so these were actually at the counter, and I am a magpie, so when I saw this, hi there, hi, I lost my shit and bought lots of them. Let's see how many I bought. Okay, so I don't know if I'll ever use them, but they're shiny and they're sparkly and I wanted them. So I've got this gorgeous little lavender stars. I got this one, this is the same one, it's just a kind of nice um, holographic version and then I got a little holographic petal, it's actually it's more kind of pearlescent, just round glitter. This one is a sweet little mermaid kind of colour, uh, yeah, and then this is the first one I showed you, the holographic, yes, okay so the other, actually that's not holographic, that's pearlescent, this is holographic. Um, that's probably my favourite one. Oh my god. <sighs> Can't wait to use them. Oh, mm, no way! I can't get over how 
cheap everything is. Okay, so there were 12 zloty, which is two pounds 41. <sighs> two pounds. Less than two pounds 50 for these cute little things. Again, if I had realized how cheap it was, I probably would have bought more. This one I got because everybody raves about this. This is Inglot Eyeliner Gel Eyeliner. Um, so many makeup artists have recommended this, saying this is the best eyeliner they've ever used. I don't know, never used it before, so I'm gonna use it. I've got clients in later today, so I'm gonna give it a wee bash. Oh, it's got a tin foil lid, so I can't swap it. But the, the, the people that I see recommend it are amazing, so I don't doubt them for a minute. Okay, so I think that eyeliner was 44 zloty, which is about £8.80, just under £9, which is mad. So these are the last two little things that I bought from Inglot. They are called Body Sparkles. They are both vegan friendly. And these are so pretty. Again, I'm a complete magpie. So when I saw it, I had to get it. Oh my gosh. I'm going to swatch this for you so you... Oh my god, I forgot. Hang on. I can't believe I just did that. What an idiot. <sighs> did it look like ah! Oh my god, I'm such a dickhead. <sighs> well, that serves me right. So it looks like that. So now I have a massive swatch in my hand, so let's just. Yes. So I'm just gonna make myself nice and sparkly. I can't believe I did that. Okay, I'm gonna try and be a little bit careful. This next one is the same thing. I'm gonna really try and not do the same mistake. Have I bought two of the same? I think I've bought two of the same and I don't care. Hi, future me here. Um, so it turns out my camera cut out without me knowing, which is really annoying. Anyway, you didn't miss much. I was just kind of babbling about the Inglot pigments, which by the way, I did not buy two of the same. They were different. So I've just finished talking about them and I'm now about to show you what I bought in Sephora. So the first thing I got was the Versali. Um, it's a unicorn essence. It is a skin enhancing antioxidant serum. I bought a small version of this when I was in America last year and it sits so beautifully um, pretty much on everybody's skin. I put that on before moisturiser and it just makes everything sit really, really nice. For Sally Unicorn Essence, it was 219 zloty, which is about £44. The only thing is with Sephora is I think it's pretty much the same price structure everywhere you go. So I don't really think the pole in Poland it's much cheaper than if I was to get it in America or anywhere else. Next up I bought, I bought these foundations from Too Faced. They are Peach Perfect Comfort Matte Foundation. Now I bought a couple of these, again actually I bought three of them last year and I love them so much. I'm actually wearing um, one just now. I use it on my clients who don't want a heavy base, however I used it on myself and I am obsessed with the coverage. It's very buildable, it's matte, so it's particularly good for people who've got oily skin um, or just want a matte finish. I got the shades Nude, Porcelain and Warm Nude. Again, the prices are pretty much the same. They were 165 zloty, which is about 33, 34 pounds. I would pay that in America, I'd pay that in the UK. You know, these you can get in um, like Debenhams and things. Um, and yeah, again, it's the same. One thing I will say about this foundation is it smells incredible. It's infused with peach and sweet fig milk. They smell so good. Next up, I got these two reusable cooling eye gel pads. These are for myself. I bought these for me. Um, they're heart shaped, they're really cute. I'm gonna stick these in the fridge and put them on my eyes because my eyes have been really puffy recently, actually. Blah, 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 blah. Fantastic. I think um, they were about five pounds to buy. Oh, this. Um, actually, this is a good point to make. So this little hand cream I got for free. It's super cute. It's watermelon flavour. Flavour. It's not flavour. It's scented. Um, I actually got this for free with my points. Now, side note, I have a Sephora card that I use in America. Um, however, in Poland, you cannot use your Sephora card. You've got to get a separate card, which can only be used in Poland. And I think, I'm not 
100% sure, but I think it's because they've got their own currency. Um, so the card that I got, um, I can only use that in Poland. So I now have two Sephora cards. And when I paid, this was one of the little treats because um, I'd built up a fair few points already, obviously. Next up, I get, oh yes, yes. I bought a whole bunch of brushes. So well, this first one is a Sephora brush. This is the Pro Flawless. I don't actually want to take it out completely because I've still got that glitter all over. This was a Pro Flawless airbrush brush. Um, this looks like a really nice foundation brush. You can't really see it at the moment. Again, I don't want to take everything out because my hands are still clarted in glitter. These brushes were super cheap. I can't find a receipt. The other brushes I got were some of my absolute favourites. Um, one of my favourite brands is Zoeva. When people ask me what brushes I recommend, I always say Zoeva. They're so good. So I got this one, which is the 110 Face Shape Blush and Contour Brush. Got the Buffer Brush, the 104 Buffer Slash Foundation Brush. I also got the 231 Luxe Petite Crease Eyeshadow Brush. They don't really lose their bristles either. I got, hang on, here's a Zoeva brush, it doesn't even have a, uh, the 231, I got that maybe like four years ago. Use it constantly and it's still in great shape. They're, honestly, I cannot recommend Zoeva enough. So yeah, the 231, which I already have a bunch of them, but I just really like it. And also the 105 highlighter brush. The 105 brush was 82 Zloty, which is about £16.50. Cheap. The 231 eyeshadow brush was 53 Zloty, which is about £10.60. The 110 blush contour brush was, was 66 Zloty, which is about £13-14. This was probably the most expensive brush. That was 86 Lotte, which is about £17. So even the most expensive brush is still less than £20. And the quality, as I said, is so, so good on Zoeva. Next up, I got the Sephora Beauty Amplifier. Now, this is a um, primer, and it's one of my absolute favourites. I don't know, the ones I normally get are like in a kind of longer tube, so I don't know if they've stopped doing that. Um, it's a Perfect and Glow Primer. This was 69 Zloty, which is about 13, 14 pounds. Again, it's pretty much the exact same what I pay in the States. And it's beautiful. If you go to Sephora, I 100% recommend this as a primer. It's absolutely beautiful. I think that's all I've got in Sephora. There's a few other things I bought that weren't in Sephora or Bath & Body Works, which I'm just going to show you quickly. I bought a whole heap of face masks, peel off mask, a blueberry mask, veggie skin diet, oh what's that? I don't know what that is. So I bought a whole bunch of these, um, these were just from a little drugstore, I can't remember what it was called, but they were all about, I think they were 3 dollars Zloty, which is about 80 pence. So like, I mean, hey. I got a couple of things in the airport on the way home, I bought this little face mask, um, it is a PDF AC dressing and pulley mask. I don't know what I don't know what it is. It's just a sheet mask. I don't know. I have absolutely no idea what it is. It's just a wee face mask. Thought I'd treat myself. And um, that was seventeen ninety Zloty, which is about three pounds sixty. And from the airport, I also bought the Pixi Vitamin C Tonic. Um, again, I haven't used any Pixi products before, but I've heard wonderful things about them. So this says it's vitamin C and ferulic acid brightening toner. So I'll give this a go see how we get on with that. As I say I've heard really good things about Pixie so I'm quite intrigued to see how I get on with this. And that was 47 Zloty which is £9.45. So that's really really cheap. I forgot there's two things left in this bag that I forgot I got. Hang on. I've got a bunch of stuff left. Ah, oh my god, if you saw my last video from America when I did my wee Sephora unboxing then, you'll see I bought about a million of these. Um, now I think it's just tradition that I buy one. It is the Better Than Sex Mascara from Too Faced. This is a waterproof one. I went surfing 
wearing this mascara and it served me well. And let me tell you, I spent more time under the water than on top of it. It gets me through a surfing session and it'll get you through your wedding. So the Better Than Six Mini Mascara was 50 slotty, which is about 10 pounds. I also got these cute little eyeshadows from Sephora called Sequins Effect. I bought two of these, I don't know where the other one is. Haha, <laughs> found it. This is called a metal, the metal effect, and I'm just gonna swatch this for you. So I swatched it in the shop and it was amazing. So this is kind of like a champagne colour. Uh, oh well. It's unbelievable. Look at it. That was a really terrible swatch, sorry. I mean, my hands are absolutely clarted in that glitter. So <laughs> Should have done it on my knuckles. Anyway, you get the picture. That was a metal effect called To the Moon and Back. So that's super pretty. Got this other cute little one. This was the sequins effect. So there are two different effects. So the one that I just showed you is the metal effect. And this is the sequin effect. This is called Big Bang. Kind of like a chocolatey colour-ish. Right, let's see if I can do this one properly. Right, I'm going to give that a little swatch. Right, let's go for it, guys. There we go. God, I'm not very good at this. Super pretty. These were 29 zloty each, which is about £5.80, just under £6. So, absolute bargain. Now we're on to the last thing. I got these cute little eyelashes. Got two of the same thing. I love wispies. These totally appeal to me. They are just whis nice, wispy lashes by a brand called Catrice Cosmetics. Never heard of them before. It was kind of like a super drug place that I got these in the face masks. I don't know why I'm so, so surprised. So there were 16 zloty and I've just looked at how much that was and that's £3.22. I really should have checked this out and bought more stuff. £3 for these gorgeous lashes. I mean, they're beautiful. So that's the end of my little crack off beauty haul. I also did some um, clothes shopping while I'm there and I think I might do a wee clothes haul. Will I? Will I? I don't know if anybody will care. Do you know what? I'm just going to do it. I don't think anybody will, I don't know if anybody will be interested but I'm going to do that for my next video. I'll show you what I bought. Do a wee fashion show. Hey. So that's the end of this video. I would adore it if you were to subscribe to my channel and give this video a thumbs up because it helps. I don't know how, something to do with the algorithm, um, but that would be wonderful if you did that. Anyway, be good to each other and I'll see you in the next one.